Hello, Steve. Christopher. Hello, Christopher. How are you Pleasure doing? And you're Steve Tiller with Right Stuff Kids, right? I am. Steve and, Tiller with RightStuffKids.com. And this is one of your uh, books called Just Be Yourself. Can you tell me about the inspiration behind this book? Yeah, Just Be Yourself started out, I started out to write a book about differences. And this was the book we started out to write, write, write. And it was about, I had some friends in wheelchairs, and I wanted to do a book that kind of honored their struggle. Mm -hmm. And because it's, you know, being in a wheelchair, you're you're kind of at the belly button level always. And they had just had a child, and two of them, both of them are in wheelchairs. And they just, the, I was struck by the spark of that spirit, and it soon kind of broadened into a book about all kinds of differences, mm -hmm. which is really a book about tolerances. You know, mm -hmm. my books are about fruits of the spirit, and so this one, that one is about tolerance. And as I got through that book, this the rhyme was really still stuck in my head. Mm -hmm. And so we, I finally just wrote, that one took two months, this one took about three hours. Mm -hmm. It didn't really take that long, it took much longer, but it mm -hmm. was a, it went very quickly. And it's just a marvelous book that parents love to uh, share with their children. And it has such great advice uh, for kids. And it's really all the stuff I had a lot of fun writing this book because it was kind of really all the various stuff that I've learned, kind of that I've learned from my own experience with with uh, with God. You know, just be yourself. Hold your flying house. Shot to the heavens, name for the sky. There's just one on the planet exactly like the, you. There won't be another. There can never be two. And I go to schools and really talk about that to kids because mm -hmm. if you think about it, you know, you're there's never going to be another time when they exist on this in this earth. They may they may go on, you know, if they. But it's a, uh, for right now, we each have a message that we can share and inspire other people around us and help other people. And it's important that kids understand they have that power contained within them now. And it's their, their only time they're going to be here able to do this work. And they really, it's very important that they kind of become all that they can be. So says, Phil, you don't know who you might be? Just keep living life, and then you will see. Things get easier with practice, you know. You'll learn to do it. Give it a go. Hold on real tight. Keep your eye on the wave. Trust in yourself. Be bold and be brave. The pilot of life wants you to fly high. Say, so take wing together and soar through the sky. It's just got a lot of just wonderful, you know, always be nice. Don't feel remorse, but set your own sail and sail your own course. So it's just got a lot of really wonderful kind of, anecdotal things that these are very positive that, affirmations uh, oh yeah they're mm -hmm. just very really, encouraging really great stuff you know and i always kind of felt dumb when i was a kid so i have a lot in here about that can you play tennis do you like to chew gum don't you love food do you ever feel dumb i'll tell you a secret i felt that way too until i remember all the great things i can do yes all of us are terrific at some stuff we do and all of us stink at a lot of stuff too so it's just really a wonderful book for teaching kids that it's really not only okay to be different, but that's the beauty of who they are, mm -hmm. is that they have this wonderful ability to be uniquely themselves, and they need to express that as best they can and try to help carry that message to other kids, to uplift other people. You know, we're kind of really all in this life together. You know, believe in yourself and always be fair. Thank others for helping and remember those prayers. You know, whatever you do, give it your best try. Life has no limits, so always aim high. Aim high. That's a good message. So, yeah, it's just a little... Children need to aim high, don't they? Yeah, they do. They should sure do. Really... Um, so it's just a... Uh, and the artist that we used for this book was a... He was also uh, in a wheelchair. He oh, was, was a... He? Yeah, he was a paralyzed... Uh, he was, had a massive stroke. And so we, we used... that. We did this book slightly differently instead of doing the art to the words, we change the words to meet the pictures. Mm -hmm. His name is Harry Teague. He's a folk artist up in, uh, mm -hmm. uh, up in uh, uh, Cartersville, Georgia. Great. And the title for this book? The title book is Just Be Yourself. Just Be Yourself. And the best way to reach you, Steve? Uh, it's uh, Steve Tiller at uh, writestuffkids.com. And uh, your email is Steve at, Steve right at stuff, writestuffkids.com. Writestuffkids.com. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, Steve. Beautiful book, Just Be Yourself. Writestuffkids.com.